in this video let me consider one numerical on source transformation reduce the circuit shown below to a single voltage source in series with resistance that is single voltage source in series with resistance let this terminal is a this terminal is b so we supposed to convert or reduce this entire circuit to a single voltage source in series with resistance let me simplify this so this is the given circuit here we can observe that no any registers are in series or in parallel so here we can apply source transformation to simplify this circuit further so here 10 volt voltage source is in series with 2 ohm register that is if voltage source is in series with register we can transform voltage source into current source that is i can write here i is equal to v by r so here v is 10 and register value is 2 so which is equal to 5 amp so i can replace this voltage source by 5 amp current source and this 2 ohm is connected in parallel with current source similarly here also we can see that a voltage source is in series with register i can write i is equal to 12 by 3 that is equal to 4 amp so this 3 ohm is connected in parallel with 4 amp similarly here also there is a voltage source in series with 2 ohm current source i can write i is equal to 5 by 2 which is equal to 2.5 amp so let me transform all these voltage source into current source so here the magnitude of the current source is 5 amp so here the plus this is plus and this is minus we have to give the arrow mark like this this that is head end of the arrow is towards plus tail end of the arrow is minus so the magnitude of this is 5 amp this 2 ohm is connected in parallel with this let me connect 2 ohm similarly here voltage source is replaced by 4 amp current source the arrow mark is up direction because plus minus this is 4 amp this 3 ohm is connected in parallel with this so here we have 3 amp current source that is connected between same terminal this is 3 amp which is connected in same terminal and we have 2 ohm which is connected in parallel with this this is 2 ohm this is 3 amp So similarly, this voltage source is replaced by 2.5 amp current source. So direction of the arrow mark is down because this end is positive, this is negative. This is 2.5 amp. This 2 ohm is connected in parallel with this. This is 2 ohm. So this is terminal A and this is terminal B. So now here we can observe that 5 amp, 2 ohm, 3 amp, 2 ohm all are in parallel. Similarly here these two are in parallel. So here 5 amp and 3 amp current source are in parallel and direction is same. I can replace these two current source by a single current source by adding the magnitudes that is 5 amp plus 3 amp is 8 amp. I can replace two current source by single current source of magnitude 8 amp. Now here we can observe 2 and 2 both registers are in parallel the equivalent value will be 2 into 2 divided by 2 plus 2 which is equal to 1 ohm. So I will replace these two 2 ohm register by single register of magnitude 1 ohm. So let me connect 1 ohm in parallel with this. This is 1 ohm. So similarly here we have 4 amp. Here we have 2 amp current source. Let me connect that 2 amp here. This is 2 amp. So here 4 amp and 2 amp are in parallel but opposite in direction. So if directions are opposite, we have to take the difference. Here the difference of these two current sources is 2 amp. That is 4 amp minus 2 amp. And we have to follow the direction of highest magnitude. Here direction of highest magnitude is up direction. So 
I can replace these two current source by single current source of magnitude 2 amp. You have to take the difference as directions are different. This 3 ohm is connected in parallel with this current source. So here I will connect 3 ohm. So I have reduced this entire part further. Now I will connect these two as it is. That is to this we have 2.5 amp current source parallel to this we have 2 ohm register here we have 2 ohm register this is terminal A and this is terminal B so now let me simplify this further here we can see that this current source is in parallel with register similarly current source is in parallel with register I will convert this one into voltage source that is V equal to I R which is 8 into 1 which is equal to 8 volt. So I will replace this current source of 8 amp by 8 volt and this register is connected in series with that that is like this we have connect register 1 ohm in series with voltage source magnitude of voltage source is 8 volt. Similarly here also we can convert this current source into voltage source that is V equal to 2 into 3 which is equal to 6 volt. This 6 volt is connected in series with 3 ohm. So let me connect 3 ohm here which is connected in series with 6 volt plus minus. The head end of the arrow is plus, tail end of the arrow is minus. So magnitude of this is 6 volt. Similarly this 2.5 and 2 are connected as it is. Here I will connect this 2.5 amp and this 2 ohm as it is. This is 2 ohm and this is terminal A, this is terminal B. So now let me simplify this further. Here we can see that 3 ohm and 1 ohm are in series and these two voltage sources are in series. So I can add these two voltage sources because the polarities are same that is plus minus plus minus. I can replace these two voltage source by single voltage source of magnitude 14 volt. So we have plus minus 14 volt. So here 3 and 1 are in series that is 4 ohm connect 4 ohm in series with this this is 4 ohm and here let me connect 2.5 and 2 as it is so here in parallel with this we have 2.5 amp and here we have 2 ohm register this is 2 ohm this is terminal A this is terminal B now further let me reduce this here a voltage source is in series with a register I will try to convert again this voltage source into current source that is I is equal to V by R that is 14 divided by 4 which gives 3.5 amp so now 3 pa 14 volt is replaced by 3.5 amp current source and this register is connected in parallel. So I will take arrow mark is like this. This is plus minus. Magnitude of this is 3.5 amp. This 4 ohm is connected in parallel with this. This is 4 ohm. And we have 2.5 is in parallel with this. And this 2 ohm is connected in series with this, in parallel with this, that is 2 ohm. This is terminal A, this is terminal B. So now here we can observe that this 3.5 amp and 2.5 are in parallel. I can rip and directions are opposite. So I can take the difference that is 3.5 minus 2.5 is 1, 1 amp, direction is up. So this is 1 amp. I will replace these two current source by single current source and 4 and 2 are in parallel. The equivalent value is 4 into 2 divided by 4 plus 2 that is 8 by 
6 that is nothing but 4 by 3 so this 4 by 3 is connected in parallel with this 4 by 3 ohm this is terminal A this is terminal B so now let me convert this into current source that is V equal to IR that is 1 into 4 by 3 is nothing but plus minus 4 by 3 volts and this 4 by 3 is connected in series with this so this is 4 by 3 ohm this is terminal A and this is terminal B thank you for watching